Hello friends, in my last video, I explained you how to download and install JDK and how to set path. Today, I'll tell you how to write your first Java program. For writing your Java program, we will open Notepad. Inside this Notepad, we will type our first program. The first statement of the program should be class. Class is a keyword which we are going to use. After that, we have to take the class name. Class name we can take as per our convenience. So here I'm taking class name is a test. But remember, the first letter of the class should be, first letter of the class name should be capital letter. Then start curly braces. Inside this class test, we are going to create main function. For main function, we will write public static void main. Our main function is public. That's why we have used public keyword. Static keyword we have used because we want a compiler to call this main function without creating an object of this test class. This main function is not going to return anything. That's why we have used void keyword and an array of string type and the name of that array ARPS. Inside this main function, we will write our statement. Inside the main function, we are going to write a statement to print hello world. For this, we will write system dot out dot println and whatever we want to type here. So I want to print here, hello world. And close this and put a semicolon. Always remember to write the first letter S of this system class as a capital letter because system is a predefined inbuilt class. Close this main function, close this class test. Now we have to save this file. For saving this file, what I'm going to do, I'm going to create a folder inside D drive. Let me create a new folder here. And in the name of the folder, I'm giving Java programs. Java programs. You can give the name as for your convenience. And I'm going to store, save this, my program inside this java program folder so click on file click on save and select the location where you want to save this so i want to save inside this java program and here for saving use the same name as you gave for the class dot java our class name was test if you are having more than one class in one program, always try to save the program with the name of the class which contains main function. So we have only one class and the class name we have taken test. So I'm saving this program with the name test.java. Don't forget to write this .java extension and click on this save button. And our program will be saved inside this java program folder here you can see this program is saved now next step is to compile this program for compiling and executing this program we have to open cmd so click here cmd click on this cmd and here we have to set the location where our program is saved our program is saved inside d drive so i'm giving here d colon and inside d we have to change our directory to the java program folder where our program is stored here you can use dir command to see all the directories here you can see our java program folder is there so we have to change directory for that we will use cd command cd space and the folder where our program is stored so java space program so inside this here our program is stored using this dir command you can check 
here you can see our program test.java now we have to compile this program for compiling this program we have to give command java c space this file name dot java so our file name is test dot java and press enter java c command is used to compile if you are not getting any error or any message it means your program is compiled successfully if your program contains some error then we will get here list of errors so our program is compiled successfully now we will execute this program for executing we will write command java space file name this time we will not write this dot extension so here the command for executing this program is java space file name press enter and here you can see the output hello world so this is how you can write and compile your first program thank you so much